Sardis is the capital of the county and one of the most important trade centers of Macedonia. In the course of history, it appears for the first time at the beginning of the 5th century BC with the name Sardis, which is probably derived from the word Sirios, meaning the sun. In the passage of time, the city was met with commercial prosperity and became a significant transit center, particularly from the 18th century and onwards. Education flourished and the written arts thrived. The schools of Sardis were of great renown and conduced to the development of a most significant literary movement. Today, the city of Sardis houses several technological institutions and the Department of Physical Education of the Aristotle University. The monuments of archaeological interest in the city of Sardis are by all means remarkable. The ancient Byzantine Acropolis of Sardis is situated in the northern part of the city on a hill called Kulas. Several parts of the fort, such as Orestes Tower, can still be seen today. In the northeastern edge of the castle of Acropolis, there is the Church of St. Nicholas. In the center of the old city, the old metropolitan church of St. Theodori is the dominant feature. The church of St. George Crionaritis and the church of St. Prodromos or Prodromudi are also considered remarkable monasteries. The holy monastery of Timios Prodromos is a hallmark in Byzantine history and tradition. It is situated nine kilometers northeast of the city of Sardis in a gorge of Mount Manikio. It was built in 1270 AD by Ioannikios. Inside the monastery there are the tombs of the founder and the patriarch of Constantinople, Gennadios of Scolari. There are also wall paintings of the 14th century and the 1630s, as well as the works of Manuel Panselinos, all of which are of the utmost importance for our country. Finally, there is an elaborate walnut church icon screen carved in 1804. In the city, there are three Ottoman monuments which are very well preserved. The mosques in Zidli, the temple of Ahmed Bey and Bezesteni. The latter is a building of the 16th to 17th centuries and is located in the central square of the city, Eleftheria Square. Today, it is an archaeological museum housing the archaeological treasures of the county. Other museums of importance include the Folk Museum of Saragazzani, the Folk Museum of Vlahi, Yorgakis Olympios, the Folk Museum of Alexandros Hadzilias, the Folk and War Museum, the Folk Museum of Likio Elinidon, the Church Museum, and the Museum Museum of the National Electricity Company, Nasyujik Hydroelectric Station. Due to the numerous catastrophes that the city sustained during wars, it is deprived today of many buildings which used to adorn its streets and squares. However, the visitor can admire some buildings which have been preserved, such as the neoclassic residence of Umberto Sargiros, which houses the offices of TEDK of the County of Ceres, the one of Malios, the old mansion of Skinas, and the residence of of Dimitrios Maroulis. In the suburbs, there are also places of interest, such as the Valley of St. Anargiri, the residential area of St. John, Chrysobigi, and the Forest of Leias. Ceres is a modern city which can rival any other in terms of infrastructure, which meets all the requirements for education, sports, business activities, and entertainment.
Mm-hmm.